Well, Governor Hobbs is hoping to offer free early childhood education for students. Nine on your side's Andrew Christensen spoke with the Climbing Tree Community School and their parents about how putting children into school before kindergarten is helping their social and emotional skills. That's where these animals live. It's three-year-old Dean's first day at Climbing Tree Community School. This one is the Arctic Hare. It looks He's like already learning about exotic animals. Red balloon puppy. And how to read. His five-year-old brother Clark is in kindergarten. Thank you. His mom Kaylee Patton says because Clark was in preschool last year, his reading skills have improved. From you know him bringing me a book, asking me to read to him, to him starting to try to sound words out and him wanting to read. But Climbing Tree Community School isn't just about academics. I'm ready for school. I'm Their director April Turner says putting kids into school before kindergarten helps them learn social skills. They need to know how to share, take turns, work with the other students in their classroom. What are we cooking? And parent Garrett Flora is already noticing a difference in his four-year-old Everett. The energy, the attitude at the you know, just everything. He just he gets some exposure here that he doesn't get at home. Cheryl Kugler, a local child and family therapist, says when kids play with other kids at preschool, they learn how to deal with problems. She says they also learn how to get along, organize, express themselves, and how to speak to others. Kugler says preschool also helps parents and teachers find any delays to a kid's development so they can give them the support they need before kindergarten. Turner says their smaller class sizes in preschool helps teachers address the needs of students easier before they get to kindergarten. Cheese. Cheese. Some parents say preschool is also helping their kids learn independence. She has a little bit more freedom to make decisions and choices and see the consequences of those choices. Fred Lake says if any parents are hesitant to put their kid in pre-K, just consider it. If you think that they're going to do well and might benefit from a little bit of a head start, you know, just go check it out. Oh my goodness. Reporting in Tucson, <laughs> Andrew Christensen, Hedgehog, Kega 9 on your side. Well, Turner tells us Hobbs' plan will be helpful and is hoping it also supports professionals in education. She says they do offer subsidized child care and scholarships. Now, Hobbs is also hoping to offer affordable child care and to families and school counselors and social workers to every student.